So as I was saying, I just had to pick up some food here. As I was saying, uh, there's some exposed, um, somewhat exposed, um, we call it uh, manholes or whatever, I'm not sure what you call them, uh, sewer holes. And if you're going fast enough, it might do some damage to your car or to some tires, or it might pop a tire. Um, there's certainly bumps and things that they indicate with um, signs, but these exposed manholes, there's a section where there's enough of them that you want to be on the left lane. But aside from all that, um, just driving down this road, everybody's, you just get grumpier and grumpier with time. It's a, you, you can't expect to keep having more and more houses and the same amount of road. It doesn't work that way. That's Seattle in general. Um, but it's, you know, it's making people more irritated. It's gonna lead to accidents. Um, nothing good. And I'm hoping they add lanes. Well, they hope, I hope that they actually whatever, but um, it's something that I just, one of many, many things that drive me crazy about this area sometimes, and um, the, here's the worst thing, if someone's, if someone's tailgating you in that stretch of road, and you slow down for any one of those reasons, if they don't see you, that you're slowing down, they could hit you, and um, they'd be at fault, um, you know, people just act like idiots on this road, and it just drives me nuts. The reason why, the reason why it drives me nuts is because people tailgate. If they didn't tailgate, you could do all kinds of other things, but it wouldn't be as dangerous because you're not tailgating. Just simple, simple. Uh, let's say everybody's just going pretty quick, you know, on a more rural road, 80 miles, 80, 90, 90 miles an hour even. That's not a problem because if you're way behind somebody, you're not tailgating them. There's no problem with that. But once you start tailgating someone, it's a real issue. Um, so this guy behind me thinks it's a good idea to get right behind me, right, you know, right when I'm trying to slow down with one of these, one of these situations. And he pulls ahead of me as soon as he can. Just like, this guy is ridic just ridiculous. I mean, like, like, I have no words for it. I have no words for it. I mean, like, I have seen some crazy, crazy driving on 405. I have seen all kinds of just ridiculous behavior. But when it comes to this construction stuff, and any roads that are rough or they're just not um, not as safe to drive on, you can darn believe that people should be driving a little slower on those sections of road. I'm actually worried about my, my, car, my tires going flat now. Um, and then to top that off, when people are tailgating in that, in that section of road, it just it makes me want to get out of my car and beat the crap out of those people. Um, hopefully, we won't ever do that, but I mean, just, it just, just drives me nuts. Anyway, leave me the thoughts and comments below. Catch you guys later. Bye.